it's finally here Pokemon hype welcome to my unboxing for Pokemon let's go Pikachu edition it's two different games and uh, unfortunately for me I would have had this last night but it was no midnight release I got some background noise and the holidays are near so of course but um I'm just gonna unbox this and have a couple of videos out coming out today um and throughout the weekend less streams I'm gonna probably try to squeeze in a stream in later today and uh just go from there. I know I'm not going to catch every Pokemon. And uh, something I want to share is that the, the Pokemon Go, you can connect it with the game. And the guns, it cut, you can transfer Pokemon into it. I'm a day one player of Pokemon Go. Ever since the game came out for mobile, for uh, iOS and Android out there. And uh, I have been playing it, but I'm not going to connect Pokemon to the game because... I don't want to just try to, like, I just see it as just a shortcut and just using all the best Pokemon from all the different generations. I'm guessing you can get a chance to transfer them all outside of just Gen 1, outside of the Kanto region from all the others, all the way up leading up to the Alolan region that they just came out with a little bit, with some Pokemon in particular, not all of them, but just different generations. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to capture all the Pokemon that I can get from my own from this game and just keep Pikachu as uh, one of my all-time favorites. I decided to get this one over Eevee. Even though I love Eevee, all the Eevee illusions, I like this one the most. So I'm gonna be doing, I, I got this one instead. But one thing I wanted to share is that I would've got this last night, but they didn't get enough pre-orders, unfortunately, compared to the other, the other stores. So I had to wait till the next day for the store to open to get my pre-order right off the bat. And uh, I guess most people, were really hyped for this game because they didn't see, oh, it's not a Pokemon game. It's not really uh, just like the original ones that they were looking for. Sure, it's, it's different. And it just when you capture, I've seen the trailer. You just capture Pokemon similar to the way that you, almost identical, the way you catch Pokemon in Pokemon Go. Well, just a couple new features, different things. You can run around the town, all that stuff. So it's not really all that bad. Uh, in my opinion, so that's why I got this game as a huge Pokemon game, Pokemon fan, diehard Pokemon, Pokemon forever, I want to say, and um, I'm going to just enjoy the game for what it is, so I'm not going to be connecting Pokemon for my Pokemon Go uh, mobile game, I'm just going to capture whatever I can get, get the six Pokemon I want to get, and train them up, grind them up, and I might just be changing my party from time to time, because that's something that I usually just been doing. From the last time I actually played a Pokemon game was from Pokemon Moon from the 3DS that I played all the way through that I really enjoyed. One of my all-time favorite Pokemon games that I ever played alongside of Pokemon Blue, which I first started on, which was the very first Pokemon game I ever played. But I'm about to go ahead and unbox this. But first, before I do that, let's see what's inside. I got my Switch charged up, Joy-Cons charged up, ready to go. I was so excited for this, and I waited all year to just try to play this game once they showed it at E3. So an electrifying adventure with Pikachu, a first Pokemon adventure for everyone. And one second, because a little bit, the camera's a little bit blurry a little bit. Let's try to change the setting so you guys can see it. There we go. So I hope you guys can see it. See, now it's much better. A first Pokemon adventure for everyone, an electrifying adventure for Pikachu. And it's in Spanish over here in the text. So you can swing the Joy-Con to catch Pokemon. See, it's, 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 see how it's almost, if you play Pokemon Go, you see how, or just, just a little bit, or just seeing people play it, it's, it's the same way. And then some people was like, oh, it's not, it's not even any battles. It's right there. You can still battle a little bit. They got a couple of gym leaders from the Kanto region, brought, uh, brought Misty and all the others, so I can't wait to get through this. I'm taking my sweet old time with this to really explore get to know that we just level up my Pokemon, grind them up, and just change my Pokemon if I want to. So it says, let's go together. You can share your adventure with a second player. So you have somebody else that you can play it with. And you can connect for more fun. You can, It says, this game connects to Pokemon Go, just like I was talking about, and a Pokeball Plus sold separately. So I didn't get the Pokeball anyway, because I'm just going to be playing it on my Switch. Right off the bat, I'm not going to be carrying it around because I think the way it works, that little Pokeball that you get, you could just have Pikachu in it and maybe some other certain Pokemon that you carry with you. And I think, they, I don't know, I'm not sure if they can level up that way or not. So I'm just going to have to find out when I go to start playing in the next few minutes to see what exactly you can do in the game. So I'm just so hyped for this game. I'm just hoping that. It has some of the features because I didn't want to watch too much of the trailers 
to just give away and spoil the game for myself. Because I'm just one of those gamers that doesn't want to watch everything that a game has and know that's everything that's in it. I want to be surprised. I don't want to just know, oh, I seen this from the trailer. I know everything about it and what's gonna happen. Oh, this is what this is when this happens. I don't like doing it. And that's pretty sweet. Look at this. They got the little map right here, so you guys can see see how small the uh, games are. It's almost like the the 3DS games. So they got the whole map right here. It's upside down, it's like it is. See, so just different ways you can still see, sort of, kind of. There's Mewtwo at the bottom. See him? I'm gonna try to zoom in a little bit. See? So that's pretty sweet. And it's, a, it's about to be a nightmare trying to catch Mewtwo. But I'm not gonna use the Master Ball. Because I never even used the Master Ball. I used the Ultra Ball to try to catch all the legendary Zapdos, Articuno, Moltres. Moltres and all them. And then Mew and whoever else I could find. But that's basically it. You know, it's no instruction booklet you know, from these games. They don't even do any do that anymore. They didn't even have one for Super Mario Odyssey for the game here. They didn't. So I'm so excited. There's the, you know, there's the unboxing. I'm so excited to play this. So I'm about to get my Pokemon Adventure on. Start it up today. Playing it all weekend. And then some days that I probably won't be streaming, I'm gonna be playing Pokemon. <laughs> and that'll be a, a a huge break from that because I'm streaming all week and then I can just play Pokemon on days that I'm not really streaming because this is going to be a video play a video playthrough and then I'm not going to show all the grinding and stuff like that and have it drag on I'm just going to be exploring the city seeing what I can do to get used to the features and get used to the controls it shouldn't be too bad but uh, I'm going to be enjoying this. Hope you guys that are Pokemon fans out there enjoy it as well. And man, maybe some people that are maybe skeptical and probably not don't want to probably get this game. And not sure if they want to get a Switch this year to probably buy this game with the game, with the console. And uh, as Pokemon fans, you might not be really interested in the playthrough or in the game itself. You could probably just check the videos out and see if you guys want to get the game yourselves. So that's it. Let me know what you guys think about the game for those who probably haven't. And maybe some people out there who uh, love Pokemon as well and how you guys are liking the game.